In this quick tip, we're going to learn about a bubble made plugin, the slide bar menu. The slide bar menu allows you to add a hamburger icon that triggers a vertical menu to the left or right of your page. This is most commonly used in mobile layouts to display your menu. To use this, we install the slide bar menu from the plugins tab. Then if we look in the design tab, we have a new visual element to use. Here we can draw the slide bar menu onto the page, just like we would any other element, and customize the menu options that this menu will display. To do this, we write out each option as text on a new line. If we preview this, we can see our slide bar menu, and when we click it, we see our options. We can then trigger workflows on each of these menu items, depending on the text itself, by matching the text to the slide bar menu's option. This is important as you can have this text be dynamic, so when comparing the slide bar menu's option to trigger a workflow, make sure the option matches the exact casing of the text for it to successfully trigger. Note you can only trigger one slide bar menu at a time, but within the property editor, you have total customization over the look and feel of your slide bar menu. You can even remove the hamburger icon and replace it with the background image if you wanted to. The slide bar menu gives you flexibility for hiding and showing menu options without needing to create it from scratch. That's it for this quick tip. For more, be sure to check out bubble.io slash academy.